Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. Two people are jogging on a track. B. A man is speaking on the phone in a cafe. C. Several workers are fixing a car engine. D. A woman is reading a book in a park. The correct answer is B. A man is speaking on the phone in a cafe. Number 2. A. Business people are discussing data near a train station. B. People are boarding a train at a station. C. A person is giving a presentation in a park. D. A group of people is attending a meeting indoors. The correct answer is A. Business people are discussing data near a train station. Number 3. A. Two people are riding bicycles. B. A man is walking through a park. C. A woman is looking at her phone in a business meeting. D. Several people are sitting in a cafe. The correct answer is C. A woman is looking at her phone in a business meeting. Number 4. A. People are walking through a shopping mall. B. A group of passengers is waiting to board a plane. C. A flight attendant is assisting passengers at the gate. D. A man is talking on the phone at an airport terminal. The correct answer is D. A man is talking on the phone at an airport terminal. Number 5. A. A businesswoman is attending a meeting. B. A woman is giving a speech in a cafe. C. People are gathered at a cafe for lunch. D. A waiter is serving tea to a customer. The correct answer is B. A woman is giving a speech in a cafe. Number 6. A. People are boarding a plane. B. A woman is writing on a chalkboard in a mall. C. A man is reading a book in a park. D. A group of students is studying for an exam. The correct answer is B. A woman is writing on a chalkboard in a mall. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Can you give me directions to the main office? A. The office is usually very busy. B. Sure, it's two blocks from here. C. Sorry, I don't work here. The correct answer is B. Sure, it's two blocks from here. Number 2. How do I reset my password? A. I cleaned the office. B. Use the forgot password link. C. I'll send you an invite. The correct answer is B. Use the forgot password link. Number 3. Who will be leading the presentation? A. I haven't seen it yet. B. Mr. Smith from the marketing department. C. Yes, I already emailed it. The correct answer is B. Mr. Smith from the marketing department. Number 4. Who will be leading the meeting tomorrow? A. The meeting was postponed. B. We don't have a leader yet. C. Mr. Jackson will. The correct answer is C. Mr. Jackson will. Number 5. How often do you take the bus to work? A. Once or twice a week. B. No, I don't like taking the bus. C. The bus stop is near my house. The correct answer is 
A. Once or twice a week. Number 6. Who is presenting the project? A. Next Monday. B. Is it mandatory? C. Mr. Lee is. The correct answer is C. Mr. Lee is. Number 7. Whose car is parked outside? A. It's a red sedan. B. It's Ms. Lee's. C. Let's ask the manager. The correct answer is B. It's Ms. Lee's. Number 8. Would you like a window or an aisle seat? A. I'd prefer a window seat. B. An aisle seat, please. C. No, thank you. The correct answer is B. An aisle seat, please. Number 9. Do you prefer tea or coffee? A. It's my favorite drink. B. I prefer tea. C. Yes, at 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. I prefer tea. Number 10. Why is the conference room booked? A. I'm not sure. B. There's a team meeting. C. At 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. There's a team meeting. Number 11. Will you be attending the conference next week? A. Yes, I've already registered. B. I need to finish my report. C. The manual is on your desk. The correct answer is A. Yes, I've already registered. Number 12. How do you get to the main office? A. I like the main office. B. It's already 5 o'clock. C. Take the bus line number 5. The correct answer is C. Take the bus line number 5. Great job so far. Next is part 3. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number 1. Are you free to catch up this weekend? I'm available on Saturday afternoon. Perfect. Let's meet at the new cafe downtown. Sounds great. See you then. When are they planning to meet? A. Friday evening. B. Saturday afternoon. C. Sunday morning. The correct answer is B. Saturday afternoon. Number 2. Could you review the financial report before our meeting tomorrow? Sure. I'll look it over tonight and give you my feedback. Excellent. Thanks for your help. No problem at all. When will the woman review the report? A. Tonight. B. During the meeting. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is A. Tonight. Number 3. I'm working on the budget report for next month. Could you provide the sales figures? Absolutely. I'll send them over by the end of the day. Great. That will help a lot. What does the man need from the woman? A. Sales figures. B. Client contact. C. Budget approval. The correct answer is A. Sales figures. Number 4. I need to book a flight to New York for the conference next week. Do you prefer a morning or an afternoon flight? Morning, please. It's better to arrive early. What time of the day does the man prefer to fly? A. In the morning. B. In the afternoon. C. At night. The correct answer is A. In the morning. Number 5. Can you help me with setting up my presentation for tomorrow's seminar? Sure. What time do you want to start? How about at 10 a.m.? Works for me. I'll meet you in the conference room. What time will they meet to set up the presentation? A. At 10 a.m. B. At 11 a.m. C. At 9 a.m.
The correct answer is A. At 10 a.m. Number 6. We're running out of office supplies. Can you order some more? Sure. What do we need? Primarily, paper and ink cartridges. I'll place the order right away. What supplies do they need? A. Notebooks. B. Paper and ink cartridges. C. Staplers. The correct answer is B. Paper and ink cartridges. Number 7. I need to reschedule our meeting from 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. today. Can you still make it? Let me check my calendar. Yes, I'm available at 3 p.m. Great. I'll update the meeting request. Thank you for letting me know. What time will the meeting be rescheduled to? A. 3 p.m. B. 1 p.m. C. 2 p.m. The correct answer is A. 3 p.m. Number 8. I received a call from our client at Johnson & Co. today. What did they say? They want us to prepare a proposal by next Friday. That's tight, but we can manage. When is the proposal due? A. By next Monday. B. By next Friday. C. By next month. The correct answer is B. By next Friday. Number 9. I need a recommendation for a good place to entertain a client tonight. There's a new restaurant downtown that's getting great reviews. Perfect. Can you make a reservation for 7 p.m.? Will do. I'll call them right away. What time will the reservation be made for? A. 6 p.m. B. 8 p.m. C. 7 p.m. The correct answer is C. 7 p.m. Number 10. I need to book a flight to New York for the client meeting. Do you have a preference for the airline? No preference, just the earliest flight available. I'll check the schedules and book it right away. What is the man's main concern for booking the flight? A. The cost. B. The earliest flight. C. The airline. The correct answer is B. The earliest flight. Number 11. Are we still meeting with the marketing team this afternoon? Actually, the meeting has been moved to tomorrow morning. Thanks for the update. I'll adjust my schedule accordingly. No problem. When will the meeting with the marketing team take place? A. This afternoon. B. Tomorrow afternoon. C. Tomorrow morning. The correct answer is C. Tomorrow morning. Number 12. I need the sales report by Friday. Can you finish it by then? I'll try my best, but it might be ready by Monday instead. We really need it by Friday, so please make it a priority. Understood. I'll make sure to complete it by Friday. When is the sales report due? A. Today. B. By Friday. C. Next Monday. The correct answer is B. By Friday. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Thank you for joining today's webinar. We will be discussing the latest trends in digital marketing. Our experts will provide insights and answer questions at the end. Please type your questions in the chat box during the presentation. When will questions be answered? A. During the presentation. B. At the end. C. At the beginning. The correct answer is B. At the end. Number 2. Our store is having a massive weekend sale. Save up to 50% on selected items throughout the store. Don't miss out on these unbeatable discounts. Visit our clothing and electronic sections for the best deals. Kimo.
What is being advertised? A. A new product launch. B. An online event. C. A massive weekend sale. The correct answer is B. A massive weekend sale. Number 3. Welcome aboard our flight to New York. We'll be cruising at an altitude of 35,000 feet. Our estimated flight time is approximately six hours. Please fasten your seatbelt and enjoy the flight. What is the estimated flight time to New York? A. Approximately six hours. B. Approximately four hours. C. Approximately eight hours. The correct answer is B. Approximately six hours. Number four. Attention shoppers, our annual sale starts today and will continue through the weekend. Enjoy discounts up to 50% on selected items. Don't miss out on these great bargains at our store. When does the annual sale end? A. Tomorrow. B. This weekend. C. Today. The correct answer is C. This weekend. Number 5. Thank you for visiting Ocean World. Our daily dolphin show starts at 3 p.m. at the main amphitheater. Please be seated 10 minutes before the show. Enjoy your time with us. When does the dolphin show start? A. 1 p.m. B. 12 p.m. C. 3 p.m. The correct answer is A. 3 p.m. Number 6. Our annual charity run will take place this Saturday at Central Park. Participants should arrive by 8 a.m. for registration. The race will start promptly at 9 a.m. and cover a distance of 5 kilometers. We encourage everyone to wear comfortable running shoes and bring water bottles. All proceeds will go towards local community projects. What time does the race start? A. 9 a.m. B. 8 a.m. C. 10 a.m. The correct answer is B. 9 a.m. Number 7. Thank you for visiting Greenfield Public Library. We offer a wide selection of books, magazines, and digital resources available for all ages. Our new reading initiatives include weekly story time for children and book clubs for adults. Please ask any staff member if you need assistance finding materials or using our online catalog. What new initiative does the library offer? A. Cooking classes. B. Weekly story time for children. C. Daily movie screenings. The correct answer is A. Weekly story time for children. Number 8. Thank you for joining today's business seminar. Our focus will be on improving workplace efficiency. Remember to take notes and engage in the Q&A session. Refreshments will be served during the break. What is the focus of the business seminar? A. Team building activities. B. Financial management. C. Improving workplace efficiency. The correct answer is C. Improving workplace efficiency. Number 9. Attention passengers, we are experiencing a delay due to adverse weather conditions. We apologize for the inconvenience and ask that you remain seated until further notice. Updates will be provided as soon as they become available. Why is there a delay? A. Adverse weather conditions. B. Mechanical issues. C. Late crew arrival. The correct answer is B. Adverse weather conditions. Number 10. Welcome to the Technology Expo. You'll find booths showcasing the latest in gadgets and software. Attend workshops and demos to learn about new innovations. Don't forget to enter the raffle for a chance to win exciting prizes. What can attendees do at the Technology Expo? 
A. Learn about gardening. B. Attend workshops and demos. C. Buy kitchen appliances. The correct answer is A. Attend workshops and demos. Number 11. Please be advised that water service will be temporarily interrupted on Tuesday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. for routine maintenance. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. Residents are advised to store enough water for their needs until service resumes. When will the water service interruption occur? A. Monday, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. B. Wednesday, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. C. Tuesday, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. The correct answer is C. Tuesday, 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Number 12. Thank you for joining us for the city's art exhibition. This event showcases works from local artists and runs through the entire weekend. There are also workshops and live demonstrations. Be sure to check the schedule for times. How long does the art exhibition last? A. The entire month. B. The entire weekend. C. One day. The correct answer is B. The entire weekend. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, the results. Already sent to the client. A, was, B, are being, C, will be, D, have been. The correct answer is D, have been. Number two, they have been working. The project for three months. A. With. B. At. C. In. D. On. The correct answer is. D. On. Number three. They are. Launching a new product next quarter. A. Planning. B. Planning to. C. Plan. D. Plans. The correct answer is B. Planning to. Number four. We need to hire employees to manage the increased workload. A. Most. B. More. C. Much. D. Many. The correct answer is B. More. Number five. The contract. Signed by the end of the week. A. Was. B. Will be. C. Will have been. D. Has been. The correct answer is. C. Will have been. Number 6. The project was delayed. The unexpected technical issues. A. Due to. B. In spite of. C. Because. D. Because of. The correct answer is A. Due to. Number 7. The report was finished. The deadline. A. In. B. By. C. Before. D. At. The correct answer is C. Before. Number 8. Despite. Busy, she completed the report. A. Being. B. Was. C. To be. D. Been. The correct answer is A. Being. Number 9. The team. On this project since last year. A. Will work. B. Worked. C. Is working. 
D has been working. The correct answer is D has been working. Number 10. He will to the office once the renovations are complete. A. Return. B. Be returned. C. Returned. D. Returns. The correct answer is A. Return. Number 11. The documents must by the end of the week. A. Submit. B. Submitting. C. To submit. D. Be submitted. The correct answer is D. Be submitted. Number 12. He was not well. He attended the meeting. A. Because. B. As. C. Although. D. Despite. The correct answer is C. Although. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Dear customers, our new product line has been and is available on our website. We invite you to check it out and offer any feedback. Best regards, marketing team. A. Launching. B. Launched. C. Launches. D. Launch. The correct answer is B. Launched. Number 2. Please be aware that the office will be closed. Labor Day. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. A. For. B. While. C. During. D. At. The correct answer is A. For. Number 3. Please find the updated project timeline attached. O. Review it at your earliest convenience. A. Hereafter. B. Herein. C. Hereby. D. Herewith. The correct answer is D. Herewith. Number 4. We are excited to announce this uh, of Ms. Johnson to the position of marketing director, effective immediately. A. Appoint. B. Appointing. C. Appointment. D. Appointed. The correct answer is C. Appointment. Number 5. Attention. The meeting has been rescheduled to Friday. Please make a note of the change. Sincerely, Management. A. To 3 p.m. B. At 3 p.m. C. In 3 p.m. D. On 3 p.m. The correct answer is B. At 3 p.m. Number 6. If you have any further questions or concerns, please do not. To contact me directly. A. Hesitate. B. Hesitating. C. Hesitation. D. Hesitated. The correct answer is A. Hesitate. And finally, Part 7, Reading, Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear colleagues, the company's annual holiday party will take place on December 20th at 6 p.m. in the Grand Ballroom. Please RSVP by December 10th. We hope to see you there. Cheers, Event Planning Committee. I'm seeing Nate Faints. By when should you RSVP? A. December 5th. B. December 15th. C. December 10th. The correct answer is C. December 10th. Number 2. Attention, colleagues. There will be a fire drill on Thursday, June 20th. Hoth at 2 p.m. Please familiarize yourself with the evacuation routes and instructions posted in your area. Participation is mandatory. Thank you, Safety Office. What event is scheduled for June 20th? A. 
a fire drill, b, a team meeting, c, a training session. The correct answer is a, a fire drill. Number three, attention commuters. The Metro service on the Blue Line will be suspended this weekend, March 12th and 13th, for track maintenance. Shuttle buses will operate between affected stations. Please plan your travel accordingly. What is the reason for the Metro service suspension? A. Weather conditions. B. Staff strike. C. Track maintenance. The correct answer is C. Track maintenance. Number 4. Dear Team, Our annual company retreat will take place from October 10th to October 13th at Lakeview Resort. Please ensure you complete the registration by September 25th. This is an opportunity for team bonding, workshops, and relaxation. Looking forward to a productive retreat, best, HR department. What is the event mentioned in the message? A. A product launch. B. A weekly team meeting. C. An annual company retreat. The correct answer is C. An annual company retreat. Number 5. To all employees, starting next month, the company will implement a new flexible working hours policy. This change aims to provide better work life balance and improve productivity. More details will be shared in the upcoming staff meeting. What is the reason for implementing the new policy? A. To reduce employee wages. B. To extend working hours. C. To provide better work life balance. The correct answer is C. To increase office space. Number 6. Our upcoming team building event will take place at Lakeside Park on June 12th. All employees are encouraged to attend for a day of fun activities and bonding exercises. Lunch and refreshments will be provided. Lunch and refreshments. What is the date of the team building event? A. June 12th. B. August 12th. C. July 12th. The correct answer is A. June 12th. Number 7. Dear subscribers, we are thrilled to inform you about our new premium membership plan. This exclusive offer includes additional content, ad-free browsing, and priority customer support. Upgrade your membership now to enjoy these benefits at an introductory price. What is the main advantage of the new membership plan? A. More vacation days. B. Access to additional content. C. Participation in a giveaway. The correct answer is B. Access to additional content. Number 8. Attention passengers. Due to unforeseen circumstances, Flight 782 to San Francisco has been delayed by two hours. We apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your patience. Please check the monitors for updates. Regards, airline staff. What is the announcement about? A. A flight delay. B. A gate change. C. New in-flight services. The correct answer is A. A flight delay. Number 9. Our latest software update includes several new features and performance improvements. Be sure to download and install the update to take advantage of these enhancements and keep your system running smoothly. What is the purpose of this text? A to address system issues. B. To sell a new software package. C. To inform about a software update. The correct answer is C. To inform about a software update. Number 10. We are writing to let you know about an upcoming upgrade to our online banking system, which will take place on the weekend of October 23rd. The website will be temporarily unavailable during this time. We appreciate your patience and will notify you as soon as the upgrade is complete. What will happen on the weekend of October 23rd? A. Website redesign. B. 
Online Banking System Upgrade C. Launch of a New Service The correct answer is B. Branch Opening Number 11. Hello everyone! We are pleased to announce that our company will hold a charity run next month to raise funds for local schools. All employees are encouraged to participate or volunteer. More details will follow. Regards, CSR Department. What is this announcement about? A. Hosting an annual party. B. Organizing a charity run. C. Launching a new product. The correct answer is B. Organizing a charity run. Number 12. Dear patrons, we are excited to announce that our library will extend its hours starting next month. The new schedule will include evening hours on weekdays and additional hours on weekends. Visit our website for full details. Sincerely, the library staff. What change is being announced? A. A renovation project. B. Extended library hours. C. New book collection. The correct answer is B. Extended library hours. Number 13. Dear residents, please be informed that there will be a scheduled power outage on Thursday from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. for maintenance work. We apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your cooperation. Regards, Maintenance Office. When will the power outage occur? A. Friday from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. B. Thursday from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. C. Thursday from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. The correct answer is C. Thursday from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. Number 14. Dear Clients, Our office will be closed on Monday, November 22nd in observance of the national holiday. We will resume regular business hours on Tuesday, November 23rd. Have a great holiday. Best regards, Client Services. Why will the office be closed on November 22nd? A. Due to a staff meeting. B. In observance of the national holiday. C. For office renovations. The correct answer is B. In observance of the national holiday. Number 15. Dear community, we are delighted to announce the launch of our community garden project. Join us next Saturday at the park to start planting. All tools and seedlings will be provided. Let's grow together. Warm regards, the green team. What is being launched by the community? A. A community garden project. B. A public library. C. A recycling campaign. The correct answer is A. A community garden project. Number 16. Dear clients, as part of our commitment to continuous improvement, we are pleased to introduce a new customer feedback system. This will allow you to share your thoughts and suggestions more easily. Look out for an email with more details next week. Best regards, customer service team. What is being introduced? A. Extended support hours. B. A new product line. C. A new customer feedback system. The correct answer is C. A holiday message. Number 17. Dear team, we are pleased to announce that our annual team building retreat will take place from October 10th to 12th. All employees are encouraged to join for an opportunity to enhance teamwork and collaboration. More details will follow soon. What is the event being announced? A. Office renovation. B. Quarterly business meeting. C. Annual team building retreat. The correct answer is C. Annual team building retreat. Number 18. Dear subscriber, we are pleased to introduce the new version of our mobile app, now available for download. This update includes several new features and performance improvements to enhance your experience. Update now to enjoy a smoother and more efficient app. What is the purpose of this message? A. To report downtime. B. To announce a new app version.
C. To unsubscribe. The correct answer is B. To announce a new app version.